about half of this container in the bag. These are horse feed pellets, sweet feed. Cream corn. From my experience, the half a container this is a 42 ounce container half a container and one can of cream corn makes a pretty good uh, consistency and I'm trying something a little different today I got this leftover uh, strawberry preserves about half a jar and put that in there too I like mixing it up in a plastic bag like this. If you fill the bag more than half full, it doesn't work because there's just not enough room for the stuff to move around inside there. But about a half a bag of this is a, about the right amount for me for one session of fishing. And there it is. I'm going to let that sit for about five minutes. Let those oats absorb some of those flavors, some of that corn and strawberry, and we'll get fishing. And I will be using my homemade boilies for hook bait today. These are garlic and corn flavored boilies. Really firm. They're just really durable. They have a lot of scent to them also. Yeah, that packs nicely. Okay, that's going to be the rig right there. Where I'm fishing here, it's a really gentle incline out to probably about, I don't know, six, seven feet deep. And then there's a drop off that goes down to about 12 to 15. And what I want to do is get my bait right at the edge before the drop off there, just be near that deep water. And to do that, I gotta cast it out about at least 50 yards. Okay, welcome back. Uh, here at Big Lake today, uh, doing a little fishing with the family. They're off uh, exploring the lake shore right now, but Got uh, five rods behind me here. Uh, three of them are going to be for carp and two for catfish. Uh, however, uh, the uh, the carp bait's got some strawberry flavoring in it too, so I think that could easily attract catfish too. So I still got cut carp from the freezer, so that's what I brought today. But uh, a guy uh, just down here a little ways uh, was nice enough to give me some uh, shad that he had just caught. So that's what I got on there right now. It's just some fresh caught shad, just some little shad. You know, three inch uh, shads. Stick around and see what happens. Thanks for watching. Yellow bass. Okay.
Got one. Oh. Oh. Got loose. Oh, never mind. Oh. I got a crawdad. How'd that happen? <laughs> That's weird. I had something heavy on there for a second. Wait, maybe that was in his mouth. I don't know. Yeah. That's on a crawdad. Maybe a fish was just like fishing in Maybe it was like swallowing that or something. I don't know. Cool. That's a first for me. There we go. I don't know what the fraud had. Fish. Fish. Something pretty decent, whatever it is. Yeah, go grab the net. Six pound line here. I think it might be a walleye. Come on over here, buddy. It is, it's a nice walleye, I think. Maybe it's a white bass. White bass. Get him. Yeah. That is a dandy of a white bass. That is a dandy of a white bass. That's probably, I don't know, he's probably a pound. Oh, yeah, we're going to keep him. These are good eating. Gold spoon. I've been fishing all day. Catfish and carp lines sitting soaking all day long. Nothing. It's getting dark and finally starting to get some white bass action. Fish. Don't need the net for this one. Okay. Another white bass. <laughs> Lot smaller one. A little bit more, see if I can catch a couple more so we can have enough for a dinner. If I don't catch any more, we'll just let those two go. Fish. <clears throat> Another nice one. It's yellow this time. Okay. Okay, I'll do it. Which one? The one on the left. Just the one? The one on the far left? Yeah. There's a fish on it. There is definitely a fish on it. Yeah. Tell you what. Hold on. Take this rod. Put that down. I want you to hold the hold this and fight that fish for a minute. I'm gonna grab a headlight. Fighting him? Okay, mm -hmm. keep that rod tip up and keep the line tight. You want to keep going or you want me to take it back? Uh, I don't care. 
we need to get down by the water here pretty soon. This is the carp bait. Don't go out any farther than that, okay? It's a catfish. It's a nice catfish. You got him. You got him. Nice. Nice work. All right. Oh boy, this is a nice catfish. <laughs> it's hooked in the corner with that tiny hook carp rig. <laughs> yeah. You want to hold him? No. Nope. All right. Well, let's let's hold on to the camera. I guess maybe we'll make a video out of this after all. Well, we've been fishing for hours, finally getting on some white bass, and we just got this real nice channel cat on the carp rig. Probably about a five pound channel cat. This will be a good eater, good eater. So we got two white bass and a channel cat. I think we're gonna stay a little while. This cat smells funny. Wanting a catfish? Yeah, do you want a catfish? Uh, sure, if you don't, I guess. We got I one. Got, I still got two at home to clean. Oh, okay. We got one so far. Well, thank you. Yeah. I uh, lost one about twice as big as that. Oh, really? Yeah, that guy that- I saw you fighting a fish. I could see you fighting a fish over there. Did it come off? He went and reached down instead of grabbing the gill. He grabbed the string and pulled up on Aye. it and broke the hook. That'll do it. <laughs> so, there, now you got two. Thanks, yeah. No problem. Catfish dinner. Yeah. Appreciate it. What are you using still, that cut bait or? No, I'm using that shad you gave me. Using that shad? Yeah. Well, All thank, right. thank you, sir. I appreciate oh, it. Oh, please. My name's Mike. Tom Everybody see, seems to call me sir, but I work for a living. You know? <laughs> <laughs> no, yep, we too. Me too. <laughs> that's, that's the thing, yeah. All right. All right, well, you guys have a good night. Thanks, Mike. Oh, you're more see ya. All right, lots of. Yeah, most likely. Yeah, that's uh, close to the same size as well, the one we already got. Last cast. Oh, last cast, and I just oh, hooked to something big. swimming at me. I don't have time to turn on the light, folks. Sorry, I need both hands. Henry, I need your net, buddy. I got another big white bass. I'm gonna flip them. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's another good one. Red spider on your one of your lines over there. Okay. Yeah, it's another good one. Alright, that's gonna be it. One more white bass to finish the evening. We fished for a long time and caught nothing all afternoon until it got dark. So and a very nice gentleman down the way here gave us this nice channel cat to add to our collection. He said he didn't uh, want it, didn't want to clean it. So uh we're heading home with two nice big channel cats like this. Three good white bass. It was a good night. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.